Sometimes I'm just like, I'm so busy to do raw food, you know, I just want to just eat something fast. So I want some chips and tomato sauce, so I said I'm, I'm going to have it, I don't want to deny myself. So here, I'll show you. Here's the chips. Here's my tomato sauce, all certified organic. That's what I'm talking about. So what sort of world do you want to leave behind for the generations coming up? What sort of world do you want to create now for yourself, your loved ones, your peers, your friends, your family, the animals that we share this beautiful planet with? What sort of world do you want to create now? What sort of internal world do you want to experience? Do you want to have a greater participation in your daily reality? Do you want to have clarity so you can walk in the direction and live the life that you imagined as a child? Or do you want to be just like out of control, up and down, roller coaster? I don't know, I'm just, you know, I'm too like whacked out on like attacked by a banana or some whatever. I'm deficient, I need a supplement. I'm just too old. I've got the wrong gender type. My family doesn't understand me. I can't afford it. It's too expensive. I don't have the time. Maybe if I was, maybe if, you know, if I had more support. These are all the weak ass excuses that we put up in front of us. We build a wall of these weak ass excuses. And the only thing that's stopping us from where we are now to where we want to be is that weak ass wall we put up with those excuses that just, you know. So I say let's smash through that wall with low fat, raw, vegan clarity and some life direction. Put the pen to paper and write down some life goals. Ask yourself what you want and what you're prepared to do to get that. Because it's like, you know, it's like saying, I want to be fit, but I don't want to exercise. <laughs> I want to be healthy, but I don't, I don't want to be a low-fat raw vegan. I want endless, abundant fuel, but I don't want to count my calories. You know, it's, it's, uh, I want sunshine and beautiful weather and organic fruit, but I don't, I don't want to move out of my, you know, pig farming, snow-covered town. <laughs> Sometimes we just have to take the responsibility. Because every dollar we spend is a vote for what we believe in. Every thought we think is a vote for what we believe in. Every act we create and do is a vote for what we believe in. So what are you voting for? You know, because every moment of every day a vote for what we believe in. That's your power. Make sure you act on it. Peace.